Hi everyone, today we will learn about Golgi apparatus. Coming to the structure of Golgi apparatus, Golgi apparatus is composed of flat and sac like cisterns stacked on each other. These membranes, like the smooth endoplasmic reticulum, lack bound ribosomes. Golgi apparatus have four to eight cisterns in a stack, although there may be many more. Each Golgi apparatus is 15 to 20 nanometer thick and separated from other cisterns by 20 to 30 nanometer. A complex network of tubules and vesicles that is 20 to 100 nanometer in diameter is located at the edges of the cisterns. Stack of cisterns has a definite polarity because there are two faces that are. The sacs on the cis or forming faces often are associated with the endoplasmic reticulum and differ from the sacs on the trans or maturing phase in thickness, enzyme content, and the degree of physical formation. Golgi apparatus is present in most eukaryotic cells, but many fungi and ciliate protozoa lack a well formed structure. Sometimes the Golgi consists of a single stack of cisternae. Many cells may contain up to 20 and sometimes more separate stacks. These stacks of cisternae are often called as dictyosomes. Dictyosomes can be clustered in one region or scattered about the cell. The exact nature of its role varying with the organisms. Coming to the function of Golgi apparatus. The Golgi apparatus packages materials and prepare them for secretion. The Golgi often participate in the development of cell membranes and in packaging of cell products. The growth of some fungal hyphae occurs when Golgi vesicles contribute their contents to the wall at the hyphal tip. 